Pięka ty zoom, tak? Ja to będę osłyszał tę wiedzę. Co we're gonna do is, so this is the rocket motor hanging off the end here, the darker piece. Ти ги напоз маш од низате, низате Джош. Ти ги напоз. 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 Ти ги Yep, that's it. Yo, yeah, 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 close the for me. Get excited. Could you Dangerous. How much is it? Comes out of there for miles. Yes, miles. So more than maybe kilometer and a half. Maybe one hundred. Okay. Zeno, what is? Tell them when you are when you stack it like that. You're initiating in. Will you prime into the explosive? So your initiating in is right here. So you'd stack on top of the next one. Touch. Ordnance. Explosive is not enough though. Too short. Too short. Ah, it's 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 too short. Ja 
Today we came out to conduct a joint uh, demolition operation with uh, Kosovo Security Forces Explosive Ordnance Disposal Unit. Um, we're involved in this part of our our mission on K4 to assist and train the Kosovo Security Forces guys in explosive ordnance disposal operations. Uh, it's helping to develop their skill set and uh, we also like to come out and learn some things from them. These uh, technicians have been working with ordnance for about 10 years. They're very familiar with the ordnance found in this country and it's a great learning experience for both teams. Uh, the ordnance that we disposed of today was found in a cache last weekend um, on the close to the Macedonian border. Over uh, 350 pieces of ordnance were recovered by both uh, KSF EOD team and a U.S. Army EOD team. Uh, the ordnance was transported out and uh, kept in a bunker in a secure area until it could be disposed of later. Correct. Uh, we, we were called in to assist uh, the KSF EOD team uh, because we we come with uh, unique equipment that they don't have access to, uh, extremely good publication system, and uh, very good knowledge of ordnance from around the world. Uh, this is an important uh, mission for us to work with them on. They hadn't had the experience of dealing with this many munitions at one time before, and this is something uh, as the U.S., as K-4 draws down in Kosovo, when we hand the mission fully over to the Kosovo Security Forces, they need to uh, understand how to handle this in a safe and efficient manner, and they uh, they had a great example of that today. Did a great job. Oh. Uh, explosions by far. Um, it's it's one of the reasons I became an EOD technician. Uh, render uh, safe hazards that exist. Uh, the general public doesn't understand sometimes how dangerous ordnance can be. It deteriorates over time, and becomes even more hazardous as it gets older. Uh, for example, today while conducting these controlled detonations, we actually uncovered. Uh, additional pieces of unexploded ordnance which uh, Kosovo security forces team with an army EOD team is disposing of as we speak.